12L14, or also known as lead alloy, um, is a alloy of steel with uh, a percentage of lead in it. And uh, wow, what a machining finish. Just absolutely beautiful. I'm going to try it with a bit of high speed steel and we'll see how that goes. I think on this one, uh, the carbide definitely takes the finish. The high-speed steel didn't quite, uh, it's a little bit torn out. Uh, not quite as nice as I was hoping, but uh, we'll see what the story is. I'll try, uh, I'm gonna try a different cutter on this, tidy this up. I'm, I'm just playing with this, literally, just to find out what uh, lead alloy does, what this combination of steel does and how machinable it is. Uh, just so I can play around with it at some point. Right, you can see where the uh, 5 thou cut went to a 10 thou cut. It's kind of interesting. Uh, 5 thou looking pretty, pretty nice. 10 thou okay, but uh, so I just uh, just a little bit rougher. So with the very sharp carberry bit here uh, does a pretty nice job on aluminum anyway and not too bad a job on this but I'll try a, I'll try a different carbide cutter see what uh, see what comes of that and I'll add this to the Okay, this was a one mil pass, and uh, it really is quite uh, quite lovely the finish. So um, nice, nice, really nice. Pleased with that. Well, the things you learn—that's what it's all about. Um, so, if there's anything else comes up, I'll add it to this video and we'll see what happens. But uh, I say I think that's probably about it for this one. I would thought I'd just point out, look at those chips. Look at the curl on them. Um, even with the high speed, uh, which was homemade, uh, the chips are curling off beautifully. Just really really nice chips no great big long spindles or things or anything that get in the way and get whipped up in your beard or whatever so uh this is just so nice to machine that was a deeper cut that was a uh probably a 10 or no maybe uh closer to a seven seven thou cut across uh you can see the big difference between the the uh one thou and the seven thou this really likes a, a light finishing cut so uh, that's good to remember again there's the full piece finished with a one thousandth cut on the finishing pass and uh, really nice really really nice look at those little wonderfully curled chips